What's going on there folks, Earthmaster here checking in. It is January 28th, 2020, 11, 17 a.m. And we have a uh, pretty large earthquake coming into the seismograph stations here from a 7.3 earthquake in the Cuba region. Now, as you guys have known, uh, well, this is actually just to the west of the Puerto Rico activity. We have been seeing a continued swarm of moderate size earthquakes there for the past week or so and now we're starting to see uh well we started to see a large quake in this area just to the west 7.3 at 10 kilometers below the surface and this information is from the usgs this earthquake is definitely going to rock the planet uh, for quite some time with the p waves which are now just hitting it looks like uh, puerto rico area you can see it showing up on the data stations there uh, that's actually the main quake showing up and then a couple other smaller quakes there in the Puerto Rico area. Either way, uh, a definite damaging earthquake for those folks over there. I'm going to go ahead and check out a little bit more information in regards to the activity. Uh, let's go ahead and lower that down a little bit so it will fit the screen. There we go, 7.3 in the... Well, they got it set here at... Uh, uh, Lucia Jamaica okay but uh, that's kind of strange anyway uh, zooming in a little bit more let's check this out real quick I was just outside and heard something going on zoom in here a little bit more on the map here and we can get a better detail of exactly where it's at the population it may have affected you got Cuba up here to the north so I would say it's definitely uh well, in between Cuba and Jamaica right along this uh, fault plate boundary out here in the Pacific. This has the potential to create a tsunami. I'm going to go ahead and check this real quick. Um, one second here. On my side, I still have yet to get this thing set up here. Um, right now, they don't even have anything listed here um, at all on the tsunami site. But uh, I'm going to check another one here real quick. Got to click on this info, and I'll get that information out here. A lot of activity out there uh, in that region recently. Not seeing any type of tsunami uh, info on it. Um, I'm surprised they don't even have anything at all on it. Um, Like I say, it just happened, but they're normally pretty quick when it comes to this region. Uh, let's see here. Okay, well, I'll have to do an update video on it if I do see something pop up on this earthquake. There are quite a few people reported feeling it uh, within the area there to the northwest and also to the south east as well or northeast and to the southeast as well um, so we'll have to keep an eye on this area a lot of damage i'm sure uh well luckily this was not situated directly right over the land as it could have been uh, much much worse but uh i'm trying to see how far that area is from say for example jamaica region let's see here not super far so no doubt uh you know i'm sure people have definitely felt it um in that region here so i'm gonna go ahead and get this video uploaded uh earthquake distance from the tip of jamaica over there is roughly looks like about maybe 40 miles or so so 7.3 earthquake definitely going to be felt um out there in that region over 40 miles and I will be keeping an eye on the tsunami statement here just in case. In the meantime, we'll get back to the live stream here and get this video uploaded. Once again, a 7.3 magnitude earthquake, a large quake. Striking out there between Cuba and Jamaica region. This is just west of the activity that we've seen in the Cuba area for quite some time now. Where they've seen a swarm of earthquake activity. Stay tuned for a little bit more information as it becomes available.